I was a little worried because I didn't know how my bloodhound would react to a brand new puppy. June is such a high, strung, anxious, scared dog. But thankfully it went really good. They went to each other and sniffed and from there they were really close and playful. He will go up to her and love on her, give her kisses. They'll snuggle up and sleep together all day in the sun. It's really, really rare that they're not together. But when we brought him home, he didn't act like that. I already had dogs and I wasn't really looking to have another. But I would go to animal shelters and pet stores just to hold the puppies and like get my puppy fix. It was supposed to be another day like that. But whenever I held Kevin, I kind of became obsessed with him. He was just so different than any other Chihuahua. He's absolutely lazy, chill, lovey, affectionate. I was in the parking lot the next morning before they opened to buy him. <laughs> and then he started to get funny. <laughs> It's just me. It's just me. <laughs> These blanket monsters have just appeared to him. If he feels like our hand or foot move under the blanket, he'll start barking at it. He sleeps in bed with us sometimes. And I'll move my leg or something, and he'll try to attack my feet and my hands. So we're like, Kevin, have you lost your mind? But he was gentle with June. You can tell his mere presence makes her less anxious. That's why we call Kevin her emotional support dog. And she gets incredibly anxious and scared without him. June had never been around another tiny dog like that. And she knew that she had to be fragile with him. Whenever she puts her paw out to play with him, she knows not to do it too hard. They have a very loving relationship. She changed for the better because of Kevin. <laughs>